Thank you. Nobody's quite as emphatic as that guy, Jeff Jout. Now, here <laughs> on The Circle, we had planned to bring you a whole series of stories about unusual jobs, and we we're going to unroll those stories over the next couple of weeks. But guess what? Our jobs changed as well. So instead of a whole series, let us introduce you to just one job that is pretty darn cute. Babies come in all shapes and sizes, and funnily enough, so do careers. So what does it take to become a photographer who specialises in capturing special moments like these? I've always loved photography, so it's always been a love of mine. Um, I was a primary teacher before I had my own children, and then when I had my boys, I didn't go back to teaching, so I started out working with families and younger children, and then gradually moved across more into babies. That's pretty much what I specialise in now. Caroline Bowen of Beloved Photography has been taking pics of newborns for four years, and from what I can see, she's become somewhat of a baby whisperer. Just as a very well-behaved little bub. Yeah, there's usually a period of time when they're in a really deep sleep, and you've got to work quickly and <laughs> snore a baby. Quick, take the photo, because it looks good. He's got his little hand on his head. Yeah, that's pretty cute, isn't it? <laughs> There's a bit of a rule in, in the entertainment industry, don't work with kids or animals. Mm. And you're working with miniature people who you can't control, I suppose. Yeah. Why? <laughs> <laughs> well, I love it. Um, I guess I'm, I feel really fortunate to do something that I, I love so passionately and I think I'm pretty good at it so I've invested a fair amount of time and energy into learning the craft and it's a really specialised area so it's really nice. It's just a lovely thing to do. I meet lovely families and especially when I have new parents here with their first child. Yeah, they often say, oh, can you come home <laughs> with us? <laughs> Oh, he is just beautiful. I think for newborn photographers, it's part photography and part baby posing. Mm. You, of course, have to be a good photographer. You have to have all the photography skills, understand lighting and camera use. But at the same time, it's the posing of the newborn that makes a difference because the person who specialises in newborns is experienced with newborn babies and are going to be much better at posing them beautifully and also looking after your baby and their needs, which of course is the first priority in the session is that the baby is safe and comfortable and being cared for. So there you have it, the world of a new baby photographer. You can't be scared of babies. You'll be very agile and you can't be scared of poo. the adage you don't work with animals or children yeah. well in the filming of that story there was some shall we say activity and we've got a blooper reel for you have a look at this see this oh, is why it makes it an interesting job because there's not many jobs that have to deal with poo this is going to come back and bite you at your 21st birthday. <laughs> 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 Fantastic. Oh, what a little Beautiful darling. story. Now, after the break, our favourite nutritionist, Lola Berry, is going to show us how to get ourselves right from the inside out. Stay with us. You're watching The Circle.